Hey, this is David Gabriel Goldenberg from 011 Ads for Brands. And we're an agency specialized in sponsored brand advertising. And I want to share with you a little problem that many of you may be running into with your sponsored brands and that you're not even aware of. And that is what happens when a product goes out of stock. With sponsored product advertising, which more people are familiar with, if the product goes out of stock, then the ad stops being eligible and it won't run. You will not spend money trying to advertise a product that's out of stock. However, with sponsored brand headlines, because your ad is supposed to have three products, then if only one of them goes out of stock and you still have two others, or even if two of them go out of stock, and I've even seen three of them being out of stock, the ad will continue to run. Okay. And how could it be that even if all three are out of stock, that the ad continues to run? The answer is that on the landing page, right, you would have additional <coughs> products available. Over here, they've just got these two, right? But, oh, see, there's uh, four, seven, eight, nine. I don't know how much of this is repetition. I'm not checking really how many of these are individual, but they've got a lot of products on this landing page. And therefore, you could anticipate that if even these two products also went out of stock, this ad would continue running. And clearly, Stacy's isn't monitoring it so closely or maybe free to late. But you guys can learn from their problem. What you need to do is, yeah, you need to check your main keywords if you're running product collection sponsored brands. That's this kind of ad where you have the three products showing you need to check if they're still in stock and you need to coordinate with whoever is managing inventory for you and see, hey, you know, what products have gone out of stock this past week? And you can use a bulk operations file to see which of those also appear in your, um, in your headline ads, right? So in the bulk operations file, you've got a column called Creative ASINs. Right, so this is your creative, i.e. your advertisement. And you just need to do a VLOOKUP to see if that uh, ASIN, which went out of stock, appears in any of the creative ASINs, and then that tells you what you need to refresh. So depending on how popular your sponsored brands are, you want to do this weekly, monthly, whatever, but you don't want to keep running ads that are not going to get you the maximum click-through rates and conversion rates because you'll pay more on ACOS, You'll pay higher cost per clicks. Your competitors will be able to come in and take over your impressions and sales and so forth, right? So this is something to keep an eye on. If you've gone out of stock, right, just get a report from your inventory manager with the list of ASINs that are out of stock. And then write a simple Excel VLOOKUP. If you don't know how to do a VLOOKUP, just Google it. It's really simple, like it, like it sounds, V-L-O-O-K-U-P. Okay, it's a simple Excel formula, and that allows you to compare two pieces of information, right? It allows you to compare your list of ASINs that have gone out of stock with the creative ASINs column to see if one appears in the other. And then it'll tell you, yeah, this appears here and this appears there. And based on that, you can find out, hey, these are the campaigns that need a refresh for the creative. Like I said earlier, my name is David Gabriel Goldenberg from 011 Ads for Brands. And we're specialized in sponsored brand advertising. If you need higher performance from your sponsored brands, you want to improve the profitability, improving the ACOS, you want to increase your sales significantly, take market share, all these things, we're able to do that. And we care a lot, a lot about our clients. You can see that in our testimonials on the site and on YouTube. So thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this, if you learned from this, please, please subscribe to our channel. Okay, and we'll have, please God, more great tips coming to you soon. Thank you.